Hey, chat. Chat, hey. Say hi to YouTube, chat. Hey, hi. 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 Hey, oh, hi. 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 Time to outrank the devil. It's Saturday. <laughs> what am I doing here? The last time I saw Bobby Francis, we got in a fight over what to name our tour van stuffed monkey. Shut the window. I told him his name is Rico, or I'll see you in hell. <laughs> you think he'll remember? Milo, Bobby couldn't remember his daughter's name while we were on tour. No, he will not remember. Friendships that long are like a marriage. Where is she? Sometimes you just want to boil a person's face off and shoot the EMTs as they come, but dying alone is just too scary to even entertain the alternative. Where's Linda? Well, we can't remember dying, so I guess I'll take your word for it. Whether you remember isn't the important part. Where the hell's Linda? You're not dead until there's nobody left that remembers you. That's why everybody wants to be famous. <laughs> Is that why you want to be famous, chat? Oh, Milo wanted to be famous. No, I didn't. Why would you say that? Uh, you know what? I don't know. Just popped into my head. Uh, don't Where's... worry about it. There's a demonic saying. Uh -oh. The longer in hell, the more you are you are. It means... Eh, who gives a fuck what it means? Let's just get out of here. Where the hell are you? Hey, uh, thanks a lot for this. Uh, just give the door gal my name. See you in there. Rock and roll. Oh, wait, she leaves without us. I forgot about that. Awesome. awesome. We are awesome. awesome. Yeah, okay. So we should just go to Satan's then, right? Like, hey, what's up? Let's just, uh, let's drink you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, yeah. Let's just, like a band-aid. Quick and easy. Right off. Right off. Thank you guys for the tips, by the way. Oh, tips, I can't do this as a living, so. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then I got high, and then I got high, and then I got high. I was gonna go to class, and then I got high. I could have cheated, and I could have passed, but then I got high. Alrighty, chap. You gotta say hi to YouTube again, because Jesus Christ, we couldn't play. The game was broken. I go to beat it, and I go to pass, and then I got high. Yeah, yeah. Hello, everyone, and welcome on into part three of After Party. I think we're finally going to meet the devil today. I think we're finally going to talk to old Lee from The Walking Dead. Old Dave Fenoy. I really hope I've been saying his name right. <laughs> Let's go ahead and call a taxi here. We're with Milo. We're with Lola. We are in hell, and we are trying to find our way out. And the only way we find our way out is if we outdrink the devil. There are people saying hi underneath me because we're live streaming on... Wait! Before you go, it's time for your review! What? Ah! Psychological assessment or bumblefeed personality quiz. You know, whatever you want to call it. First of all, you intentionally chose to be a drink mule for somebody named Linda, of all things. Instead of aiding that poor little demon who needed help apprehending a dangerous homo sapien. Either you thought this sounded more fun, or Lola likes just blindly following Milo around. Which, either way, I mean, getting a vodka soda for someone does sound simple. <laughs> hey, it was a margarita. We're, we're going to Satan's party. All right, all right, all right. So you needed to find a band to fill Linda's slot. Which saps did you enlist? Oh, wait, I was there. Sorry, I already know. It was the Chanters. <laughs> Why the fuck did you pick these guys? You know the instant Ono oh sobers up, she's going to realize you traded three-day-old coffee for curdled rat milk. I mean, have you heard their singing? I, I don't know if you have a hearing disability, but <laughs> they're not good. Hey, Ono made the deal herself, okay? I'm not going to feel sorry that we swindled the, the demon that invented swindling or whatever. I guess we'll see if you can maintain your apathy when she circles the wagon back for a renegotiation. Okay, fuck 
factoid time. Okay. Thought you might want to know what's going on in the land of the living. So while you were busy accomplishing this very important mission, instead of, you know, getting your ass off the fucking couch and contributing to society in any sort of meaningful way, one Vlado Gavajic lost his hand in a factory farm accident in Lenawee County, Michigan. Due to lax regulations, his meat will be served along with the other 93,000 cows slaughtered today. Uh, really? 136 murders were committed that will never be solved. 28 of these will cause their assigned detectives to <clears throat> verbally abuse their spouses tonight. <laughs> Wormhorn. And of course, ah, uh, wait, sorry, those are out of order. Wormhorn. <laughs> Lola won that dancing thing on her first try, you giant ass dork. Who the hell is good at this stupid shit? Get alive! <laughs> so, why are you doing this? Wormhorn, just, why the hell are you doing this, huh? Why am I, it's my job, Milo. It's what I was created to do. Sired by your mom using psilocybin mushrooms when she was pregnant. So, <sighs> fine, whatever. I'll talk to you, I'll talk to you later. Okay, that was Wormhorn. Uh, so, like I was saying, underneath me is the Twitch chat, and they said hi to you, YouTube. So if you want to watch these streams as I do them live, Twitch chat is available in the link in the description, twitch.tv slash wingpoint. And we stream every day, and we'll be doing Luigi's Mansion on Halloween. And now we're going to call a taxi. So, I have a feeling that Wormhorn is going to be the person being tormented by the time we're done with this. I think if you choose your words wisely with Wormhorn, I would not be surprised if we could go ahead and be like, haha, we're antagonizing you. That's my guess. <clears throat> hey, someone order a ferry? Had to go with Miss Landon. Uh, I guess. I got the invite, so yay. What a long face. Personal demon dragging down. <laughs> Listen, just remember, those things are like car sickness. Just keep your eyes on the horizon, it'll go away on its own. And sometimes you just need to deal with it to get to the mall, you know? Anyways, did you get the invitation? We did, actually. Get the fuck out of here. A whole VIP cut the entire line invitation for an already free drink? What does uh, she really want? Yeah. We had to cover for her. We had to uh, find a band to play her time slot. What band? I don't even worry about it. It wasn't three ill-begotten chanters, was it? You're psychic, you're psychic. It's all over, Bicker. Oh, cool. <laughs> Anyways, I imagine you'll be wanting to go to Satan's now, right? Finish the game. I, I mean, whatever. <clears throat> Finish the game. I like that she keeps breaking the fourth wall. It's a little funny. There was another time earlier in the playthrough where she's like, I'll tell you that in your second playthrough. I was like, oh, okay. Well, I'm really excited to meet this guy. Objectives, hell of an invitation. Bring your invite to Satan's party. Rock and roll hall of fame. It says sorry, <laughs> cause it's a bad joke. Well, let's go to Satan's place with the invite. And let's listen to a little bit of taxi talk. Welcome way. All right, your request is my, uh, my thing that you do when requested them. Command. Let's go. No, not doing that. Ain't going down that path. This game is chock full of great voice actors. Every man will have his favorite day, but few will know about them. This will... This should be one of your favorite days, I think. They, uh, camel hair better, at least, than bottomless fries Friday. VIP invitation to Saints house party. That's uh, you guys are doing, you're doing well. You, you're doing good. I don't have any poppers or noisemakers, so hopefully the ride, in my genuine amazement, will suffice. Day, hey, I mean, we couldn't have done it without your help, Sam. You were the steed to our, to our gallant knights. Yeah, and uh, word of advice, if you make it back topside. Maybe don't talk like that at your first job interview. <laughs> oh, yeah, when we get back, we'll be like adults. Oh, a little nervous about rolling over from Miss and Mister to Ma'am and Sir. And uh, depending on your income level, either having to read train schedules or carrying out the estate tax. No, it's it's not it's not leaving school so much as Milo and I have known each other forever. 
Yeah, like genuinely forever. We got paired up in preschool because we were the last picked in the buddy system. And while Milo stayed in town to help his mom mend her magic shop. Lola's moving across the country to live with her dad. Sounds like you guys are just erupting with excitement over all the new opportunities afforded by your continued cellular reproduction. Duh. <laughs> yes, absolutely. definitely. Absolutely. Doubt. Yep. So, completely switching topics. Satan's party, huh? Very exciting. Top shelf. Roman Coliseum, Yang Zoo on opium. Mother, don't look at these pictures and stuff. Get away the Ouija boards and voodoo dolls, kids. Does anyone that be answering is too busy getting their nipples twisted? Why don't you take a break and join us? Well, I'm not waiting in that line. Well, if we find an extra invite, we'll just, uh... I'm not exactly the partying type, kids. I drink alone. Or with one other person. I guess fair enough. I wonder what the twist is gonna be. By the way, when it gets a little laggy in the taxi All right, ride. Candle flies. Have fun. You know, enjoy yourselves. Thanks. And uh, before you scamper off, two things, okay? Sure thing. One, Sam, sorry. Are you are you on tonight? Are you? Where are you headed? Sixth circle. Lucifer didn't show up for the inspection last week. And now I gotta make sure the stone coffins are being heated properly. Like I don't have enough poke to worry about. Yeah, seems like it's a death style now. Wait, Satan didn't show up for work? Wideganger, sweat cooker of infidels, this is Milo and Lula, recently deceased. Yeah, congratulations. I'm foreman down to Coffin Mines in the city of Diz. And no, he didn't. Even though we had the appointment at 11, so he could sleep in. <laughs> Anyways, can you help me out? I know it's out of the way. No, I'll give you a ride. Great, thanks. I'd swim, but the lava starts hurting if you're in it for too long. Wait, Sam, what were your two things, uh, two pieces of advice? Was I gonna give you two? That seems excessive. How about one? <laughs> I'll give you one. Okay. Do you want to hear the first thing I was gonna say, or the second? Oh, thing? come on! Oh, sorry, we just ran out of time for both. Isn't this washing bear? Uh, the second? Don't be intimidated by Morningstar. Satan? He's tall, he's had kings and queens commit atrocities in his name. And you can thank him for the hurricanes winning the Stanley Cup in 06. <laughs> but at the end of the day, he's still just a boy. With worries. Um, okay. Text me if you need to ride somewhere. Yeah. Sure. So I was gonna say... Uh, what do you think Sam meant by that? He's just a boy with worries. That was a weird thing to say, right? Like, he's probably not he's just a boy with worries. He's just a man. He's the everlasting mythological creature I recently just found out was real. She's just saying he's probably, like, insecure about something, you know? Like, like everyone has something they're worried about, and it doesn't matter how rich or powerful they are. Oh, like that guy in a nice suit I saw crying on the street after he dropped his talk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm sure he has his problems. <laughs> Wanna skip the hustle and bustle and head straight to Lucifer's? Yeah, man. Just Satan's, please. I wonder what happens if you take the long way. Satan's, please. Alrighty. Heading on up. Maybe I can sneak it in. Okay, so when it when it gets a little dodgy when we're on the taxi, it's just because that's what happens. The game kind of freaks out. Now you know. Don't worry about it. It's not your YouTube video. <clears throat> or your stream or whatever. Because we're streaming right now. Alrighty, chat. Let's go meet the guy. Are you excited, chat? I'm excited, oh my god. I've been looking forward to this moment in this game. Let's do it. Invitations, please. We got them. Certainly. I think you'll find our names in Will Call. My name is Milo. I'm with Linda Landon, the famous acid jazz instrumentalist and musical transformationalist. Maybe you've... Next. And I'm uh, Lola. We're both with the uh, musical transformationalist. Okay, move along. There's party favors in back, but don't open his fridge. Oh my god. We did, we did it. it. Oh my god. I guess all that's left is for us to uh enter the party. Win. Yes, entering the Lord of Darkness's party is what we are here to do and what we will do. I'm a little nervous. Yeah, it'll be it'll be fine. We'll be fine. We're here for a thing and we're going to do the thing. Yes, exactly. And we'll be fine. So after you. Okay. <laughs> it'll be fine, chat. This is gonna be fun. Oh boy. Um. Hello? This doesn't, this can't be right. Uh, hello? Anyone here? 
Is it Satan's house where the where the party's at? Ah! Wormhorn, what do you want? This gotta be you. Oh, uh-oh. Uh, Does someone wanna get that? Do I wanna get that? No. Oh, it's my house. Oh, Wormhorn. Hello, you've reached the home of Jean, Barbara, and Milo. Please leave a message with a name and number and we'll get back to you when we can. Man alive, Milo. Your old man sounds very, very serious. Okay, Sister Mary Worm, asshole. Ha ha. This is my old kitchen. Great, I get it. Oh, I'm so glad. Thank you. Your memory was a little fuzzy. So I had to cobble parts of it together from Marshall Field's display sets circa 1992. Oh, bravo. Oh my it's God. highly accurate. Where's the damn accurate. party, Wormhorn? You know, the whole reason that we're here? Just give it a minute. Give it a minute. Let me do this. It'll take a sec. <laughs> Lights? Oh, boy. No, the other light. <laughs> Golly gee, it's a regular old nuclear family with two and a half kids, minus two of them. Now, when you hear the beep, we all say our names and that's it. Oh, fine. Wait. Was that a two and a half men reference, by the way? <laughs> Who cares about? Shh, 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 shh. Hey, you've reached Jean. Barbara. And I'm Marty the Magnificent. Stop. Say your real name. <sighs> Don't do anything else but say your name. <laughs> Marty the Magnificent. When did you go back to that? How old were you? Like six. I wanted to be called Marty for like a, a Marty minute. Owen Duke for a week there. Uh, there was the summer of Charlie. Yeah, so what? You knew this already, Lola. Sorry, I forgot. I just, well, we can laugh about it now. This is the seventh try. Oh, he's his mother's son. He's as flighty as she is. You realize this kind of stuff is going to keep you from making friends, right? You have to be comfortable being yourself, not pretending to be something you're But Marty the Magnificent is who I want to be. And Lola's my friend. Lola's a girl. A girl can't be your friend. Do you understand? The difference. And see. It is a complicated relationship, okay, Mary? What do you want from me? It wasn't some TV show version of whatever. It's not a big deal that it wasn't perfect. There's nothing complicated about it, Milo. Your dad's a dick. It's not a... It is that complicated. He just wants me to be happy, and he's trying, okay? He's trying. This is all extremely obvious psychobabble bullshit, Wormhorn. So I don't see eye to eye with my father. That's like a rule hardwired into every animal's DNA. I think even hamsters get into arguments over who gets the last piece of chicken. What? Mm, maybe. Or maybe he regretted getting you in the divorce instead of his daughter. <gasps> because she's a proper lady. And you, Milo, are many things, but a proper man isn't one of them. Fuck off. Just ignore her, Milo. Yikes. Lola, where? I don't care if you're scared. We drove all this way because you wanted to see the carnival. Well, we're here now, and you're going to hit the damn target. Throw the ball and dunk the clown. We're not leaving until you do. Oh, boy. Dunk me, Milo. Dunk me. Throw the ball. Throw it and dunk me. She's going to smack it out of the way. Oh, boy. I suck. Christ, lean in. Move closer. Dad, will you just lay off? I'm trying. Don't embarrass your family in front of all these people. <laughs> a little heavy here. Son, come on. Why did that this work? This isn't how I taught you. Throw from the shoulder. Follow through. You know what? Screw this. I'm not playing this anymore. Ah. And screw you, Wormhorn. My dad, he's not the best. But he's not this total fucking monster you make him out to be. And also, give the guy a damn break. He works like a dog and doesn't speak English that well. Uh, you know, I was gonna try that, but it was super racist sounding. <laughs> and, you know, <laughs> there are limits. Milo? <laughs> Is that you? Lola, sweetie, your guy's in here. Milo, Jesus! Who are you talking to? Oh boy. I thought maybe I heard somebody else. Yeah, my personal demon. Oh, just my personal demon, Sister Mary Wormhorn. Yeah, no, I know what those are like. Milo, oh god, I'm so sorry. I turned around and it was, uh, I saw a witch doing a keg stand and uh, I didn't know where you were. Are you doing okay? <sighs> no, it's it's fine. I handled yeah, it. Yeah, you uh, you look you look good. 
So I've been missing the party here then. Where's the booze? This party has awesome. everything. Awesome, they have a ceiling I'll in take here. Take it from me, Milo. The best way to combat your personal demons is just to drink until you can't remember your ex-husband's foot hair. Ew. Which is why you'll notice my fuzzy navel is only half full. And it's my fourth in an hour. <laughs> you know what? Right now, that... That sounds like perfect advice. Milo, no. Come on, Linda. You're going to meet up with Mercury Worm, right? I did meet up with Mercury Worm. I told Jane I fucked her brother, <laughs> and she said she was glad I lost the baby. Oh! What? I thought you wanted to, like, smooth things over. Be a... Proactive with your spare me the therapy camp verbs. We hate each other and always will. The end. No postscript. Look, you're the closest things to friendly I've seen since I've got here. So I'll give you some advice. Be a coward. Do what's easy. Live a lie. There's no honor in taking the hard road. And if you don't believe me, look around. There's a lot of kamikaze pilots down here. Well, that sucked. I mean, I thought she was gonna like. <clears throat> Yikes! Forever. Be better or something. She seems. I don't know. She just seems sad. <laughs> Everybody into the blood pool. Pants off, dance off. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Let's just go find Satan and drink him under the table and get back home. Hey, dick for brains. I'm trying to mac daddy on my home skilled here, and you accidentally touched me. That gives me legal party rights to pound you into indiscriminate ash. Hey, he was just trying to get by. Well, you should have tried harder. Uh, sorry, man. Uh, I was just... Hey, so I couldn't remember if you folks wanted Dr. Tibble's Vicoco or Omen Set of Ale. So... It's him! Okay. I just mixed them both together. <laughs> oh, hi, Hightower. You wouldn't be attempting to intimidate Mr. Sangbong and Lola Wolf at my carousal, would you? Because that kind of behavior doesn't really structure well with the pack mentality I'm trying to delicately maintain. No, 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 no. You're angel of darkness. <laughs> I was. Great. I'll be out on the back patio. I got a terrific stock guy I want you to meet. <laughs> so, that's... that's Satan. Uh, what do I look like? A dictionary? I mean, you kind of look like a dick. Okay, so, first impressions. Tall. He knows our names, which I don't like. Also, he smells like a burning courthouse. I thought it was more like a hospital basement. Oh. How are we gonna <laughs> do this? You know, you hear you gotta outdrink Satan a bunch of times, and it sort of just becomes something you think you can do. Like when people say, just cut out sugar, you'll get fit fast. <laughs> Don't worry so much, Lola, okay? It's, it's been done before, right? No, it's always a great party, morning. I'm having a, a good time. If you're having a good time, Beelzebub, why don't you look like you're having a good time? Uh, I don't know. My face just isn't communicating my interior oh, thoughts. it's definitely communicating. Your head is a master orator. Trust it. <laughs> look at the tweet. You guys read it? Maybe I'm kind of in the way. Smash Mouth should have called themselves Mouth Smash. Change my mind. <laughs> I came here to get approvals. On a thousand Iron Maidens. Yeah. Scary. It's okay. You're intimidated by the size of the order. There's a deadline on this. And if we miss the quarter, where are the gluttons going to go? Huh? You want a storm. I can't stock them with the heretics. <laughs> oh, I'm not talking about work, mm, okay? No drinks yet? Not Damn. Tonight. It's not happening. It's the weekend. It's a Tuesday, Luke. And a school night. And I have kids. Yeah, I already saw them. They just love to have a threesome with that conquistador. I honestly just signed the damn order. If I could, I'd just sign it for you, but I can't do your swooping S well enough. <laughs> oh, Piso, come on, brother. I'm joking with you. You don't, uh, he's already gone. And I'm just, uh, talking to myself now. <clears throat> um, hi, I'm Milo. Um, hi. I'm Milo, and this is Lola. You know that, of course. This is a, a <clears throat> great, great party house you have. Jesus Christ. Oh, don't say that! Shit, I should not have mentioned JC. I'm sorry, I should start over. Uh, hi, I'm Milo, and this is... Albion is sick and America faints. Two more from the colonies. Cultural expats, certainly, but it's okay. We're all immigrants here. Are you having a good time, Milo and Lola? Oh God, his voice. Um, how do you, like, already know our names? There has to be a million people filing in a day, right? 
Yeah, I mean, people who don't wash their hands alone would... I know everyone, hellbound or not. But don't think that makes you two rumping, jumping generals any less special. Hey, sorry to interrupt these two dorks, but your real friends are here. Chernabog. Uh, did he bring the Pine Barons Tiswin? Because we're running dry and this thing's only like a third over. I didn't ask. Okay, Milo, Lola, walk with me a little. Oh, okay. Or as the singer told the bishop, now's the time to get extraordinarily drunk. Listen, Mr. Saint. You want to ask my permission to leave, and failing that, you want to challenge me to a drinking contest you've heard about, most probably from Sam. How far off am I? Was the contest real? So, <laughs> was the contest real? Like, it seems weird to base it all on that. Hail, Hail Satan! Satan. <laughs> oh, yes, thank you. Uh, uh, keep up the bad work. This whole thing was my idea, yet I can't take full credit. I didn't make the rules. I just created the escape clause for a soul every, you know, thousand years or so. We sing, we drink, we play a few games. It's more fun than doing your laundry, at least. <laughs> Don't talk about his dad. Why is it why is it so few if you uh, don't mind me asking? Like, you're the devil. Wouldn't you want as many assholes out there as possible? Hey, hey, boss, 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 boss. Can I? No, really, I'm not your boss. Remember? Beelzebub runs the day-to-day. -day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I just need like an extra day or two time off. My baby wants to do Halloween in Cancun, and I... Oh, fine, fine. Tell her to buy a swimsuit. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. So how does it work <laughs> exactly? We Great. just... My brother Asmodeus, this is like the eighth text tonight. It's a clip of someone falling downstairs while trying to carry a pumpkin. Eh, I'll just mark it as red. <laughs> just give me a second here. I don't want my buddies to ding dong ditch me. This has been so great. I'm loving this. Uh oh, personal demon time with Lola? No? So just give me a second here. We're gonna like talk about it, or should we just like go outside? He said give him a moment, but you know, you know, you know. I, I'm I'm a little curious to see if sitting here actually is something you're supposed to do, or if the game just won't advance. That's one thing I do kind of want to know. Like if I stand there, will I do anything? If I run back this way, will something happen? That type of thing. Because it's definitely a very choice-heavy game, right? And one of the choices you'd bargain would be not doing anything. <clears throat> so, I am kind of just want to sit here for a little bit and find out. Chat, what do you think of this so far? This is so great. I just love how casual this whole game has been. <laughs> I love how it's just like, you know, we're all here at the office, man. No big deal. Don't want to sit here and, you know, step on anybody's toes. We're all in this together. <laughs> Everybody's just trying to get by. <laughs> How long do I gotta wait though? I'm a gamer, I get really impatient. I work on the internet for a living. If I don't have my meme delivered within five seconds, I'm already like onto the next post, you know what I mean? <laughs> Going outside. I'm a bad boy. He doesn't look busy. Hey, there he it's is. It's the big guy himself. Finally. You look good. You're losing you weight. You know I'm going to make you go home and get it if you forgot. I've got a bottle of chert spit in my pocket, all right. You. I bless you, my son. Milo, Lola, meet Chernobyl, dark minister of the Seventh Circle. Yeah, hi. Morgan, the black fiend of the high seas. Pleasure. Vitala, <laughs> the spirit of disease and intestinal issues. And nice to, you know, whatever. And <laughs> Chad from Kingston, Ontario. How's it going? <laughs> um, hi. Uh, hi. Pleasure to, you know, just to just be here experiencing this. And just think, we haven't even done anything to you yet. I don't know what that was, what that meant. Yeah, go inside, I don't know. We're groupies now at this point. Come on back. I got the card game set up. Wait, we're just well this'll take two minutes, your your darkliness. We just wanna Oh wait! You're the two that are going to make a run at the big guy, right? Do the drinking contest. <laughs> what? 
My last shit weighs more than both of you put together. And she had just eaten three people, so... Oh yeah, I read about you on Bicker. Hey, we're stronger than we look, all right? You, you don't know why we're in hell? <laughs> we're scratching and sniff to you. You don't know our, our, our layers. Yeah, we, uh, we could have been strangling bus drivers for kicks on the weekend. Children, look now. I am your humble servant, truly. I worshipped your paws while you were still in the womb. Oh. But you don't know what soup you're ordering here. Well, how do we prove we can do this? Who the fuck is texting me right now? Oh, good gravy, it's Bezel still on me about those unholy reports. But what do you expect? The guy can't turn off. Polly was crawling up my butt too tonight, preaching about God knows what. Hmm. Actually, okay. I've developed a notion. Milo, Lola, you can help me out. <laughs> you can help me out and prove you can handle oh! our little, uh, test of endurance. Interested? Yeah, what is it? Uh, sure, okay, well, what is it? Track down my brothers and sisters, the original monarchs. Apollon, Espodius, Beelzebub, Onoskelis, the fallen angels, like me. And out drink them first. Oh, come this on! This way you'll be granting me a small favor. You'll be getting them temporarily off my behind, while also proving you can party with beings who have used stars as rushlights. And until you do, I'll be playing gin rummy in the parlor. Uh, I feel like I'm being forced to take the PSATs all over again, but sure, <laughs> if we have to. Joseph Foster, attorney. <laughs> it's a golden fiddle. Huh. It says on the plaque that John of Patmos could indeed play very well, but Charlie Daniels made up the rest. Huh. Interesting. I love all the stuff in the background. Look at the. <laughs> Look at the instruments. Look at the freaking jerseys. The decorate. This is so great. I love all of this. Let's go, Alice. All right. One more time for anyone whose mother just came in the room and asked them to take out the trash. If you get just two out of four monarch seals of approval on this magical and convenient parchment, then I'll ignore my friends and let you try to, as they say, out party me. And then we'll see how special my little rumping, jumping generals truly are. Any other queries before I get annihilated? Please say no. Why are we in hell? Actually, actually, yeah. Do you, do you know why we're in hell? Actually? Right now it's 6.15 in Madrid, and there's a man setting out a dress for his girlfriend that he knows will look revealing in the day, but will be too cold in the theater they're going to. And when he makes love to her after, he will think of the actress in the film and not how he picked out a dress too cold. And when he dies 50 years from now, fat and useless, he will open his eyes and find himself here. And he will ask me the same question you are asking me now. What did I do to deserve this? The real question, Milo, is what did you do? to deserve anything else. I'll be seeing you. There was a lot to unpack there. What the hell was he talking about? What, what's he saying, that we, we didn't do enough? That we were, that we were assholes for not like, Volunteering at blind animal shelters every damn day? I volunteered. Not every damn day, and not for blind animals, but like enough days, you would think. Whatever, let's not lose focus. How hard could it be to get two recommendations? I mean, I got five for my college applications, but uh, we have no idea where these monarchs are or how to find them. Oh, you know who would know? No fucking clue and no fucking idea. <laughs> no. Fucking Sam. Let's call her cab and ask her about it. Hey Satan, why are we in, why are we in hell? Let me tell you, boy, how it really goes. Jesus Christ. Oh, don't say that down here. Uh oh. <laughs> Dang, dude. That was that was a lot to unpack. So he pretty much just said that we didn't do much with our lives. Right? I wonder what the how we would how did we die thing? I wonder if we would have got a more straightforward answer. Probably not. Hey, it's the witches! Wow. You guys are good. Thank you, dearie. 
<laughs> we learned everything we know from Marie Laveau and Mother Suspiriorum. <laughs> <clears throat> so, chat, do you feel like you've done enough to not be in hell? <laughs> and the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil. That was one of the only lines of the Bible I remember from Revelations. Looks like Satan took it as a compliment. Oh, hell no! Let's go downstairs, I guess. Just walked through that guy, no big deal. Got some live music here, that's nice. I'll see y'all bitches down there. I wonder if we're gonna like find out what our torture is. I feel like this could be a pretty long game, Chad, if we gotta out drink, what, two people at least? And I'm assuming we could mess up too. You ever heard of, like, Dante's Inferno chat? It sounds absolutely terrifying. Ugh. Weird to think we're all gonna die someday. God damn it. I hate thinking about that. Fuck. Wanna go all the way to the bottom or take the long way? Let's just go. Express, please. The full ride. You got it. Check your ankles, wallet chains, uh, purses. Okay. Yeah, okay. Wait, is that Linda up there? What are you doing on the roof? Linda! Well. I guess we'll worry about that later. Yeah, Fornius already told me. I don't think I can make it. Give me a break, Sam. That's... You can make it. What the shit else are you doing tonight? Uh, my job. Who gave you that job? Erdog, seriously, I'm self-employed. Says so right on my tax records. Oh, God. Just... I know why you don't want to. I know you've been through it before, but everyone needs to participate. It won't work if it's just half or half a bit one. I'm... I'll, I'll... I'll think about it, okay? I'm thinking about it. Yeah, okay, just don't overheat, because time's running out. Oh, chat, tax returns. Ugh. I hate taxes, being self-employed. Gross. Hey, what's going on? You guys going home? What happened? We, uh, we need to start finding some demons called the... Uh, the Monarchs, I guess? The Monarchs? We said... Satan said there were four of them. That we should find two and out drink them first, because... Because... Actually, I don't really... I don't really know. I think he was just trying to get rid of us. Oh no, Beelzebub, Asmodeus, and, uh... Apollyon? Yeah. Apollyon. Okay. Well... You already know Ono, but she just went on vacation, so that one's no bueno. And Polly, she used to be a grand judge of the dead, but has since sort of retired. She's usually at the, uh, Sealed Knot. It's a demon's only pub. Okay, what about the other one? Asmodeus. Ha! <laughs> Al's going through some shit. Some people have lost weekends. This guy's had but whenever you want to head out, just let me know. We will head. Okay. Who should we go against, chap? We've met Ono. Ono's really smart. I kind of want to meet new characters, though, you know? I can't remember where we were. We haven't been to Thrall City, have we? Or is that where we started? This one's Asmodeus. This one's Apollyon. Let's do this one. I'm feeling this one. Wanna try for Asmodeus, huh? All right. Thrall City, all aboard. All aboard! Chad, are you a lightweight or a heavyweight? I'm totally a heavyweight. So, while we're riding, I might as well give you some exposition. When it comes to the drinking. The fellas and fillies you're trying to out-booze, the monarchs, they were originally angels of the highest order, seraphim. 
They'd fly around God's throne all day, telling him how great he is, and and sometimes they'd fight intergalactic, interdimensional beings from other planes of existence, trying to alter reality. Wait, what? Yeah, they left that part out of most Bibles. But anyways, <coughs> one day they got sick of being happiness fluffers for the big I am, and decided they deserve some sort of uh, profit sharing. So they revolted, led by Satan, of course. He was called Morningstar back then. But the Archangels, God's SEAL Team 6, had the equivalent of frigging nukes with God's holy radiation. Dang. And the Great War for the Stars lasted as long as a hamburger with a, uh, with a, like a, like a really big fat person. Because the, the hamburger would get eaten fast. Ooh, which one should we Did do, that, chat? Does that read? Let's try this one. God sounds like kind of a jerk, if I can say that here. Hey, you can say whatever the heck fire you want about God now. It's one of the benefits of already being damned. But don't judge him too harshly. People will kill the world before they give up air conditioning. And you think he's gonna share creation? No way. Hey, so what's over? Light seeking light doth light of light beguile. That was written by the Earl of Southampton's mistress. Any of you heard of it? No. Nope. This ain't a game show, so it's not like you lose money. What the hell does that mean? It's kind of cheating to rhyme the same word four times. <laughs> you don't... Okay, Milo doesn't remember. Look, it's from a play you were fucking in. Oh, yeah, I was. Yeah, and the girl you were in it for ended up dating your understudy. Oh, yeah, she did. Uh... I only bring up this uh, personality calcifying event because Asmodeus is going through some similar stuff. So you shouldn't really mention anything like love or relationships. Okay. Or like... Uh, doing it or having hope for your uh, future sexual lives anything like that why not you see like it going through a bad breakup the peshtigo fire was bad all right this this is more like your performance as the good lord byron a tragic disaster on every level of conception okay now now we look. got it avoid touchy feely stick to the party hardy hey party shardy works too Ew. you're wearing the right underwear Yo. it's my kind of party chat party shardy just kidding <laughs> Ooh, green liquid. All righty, welcome to Thrall City. It's like if 14th century Europe invented the skyscraper. How could a continent invent anything? How'd Australia invent killer birds that kick you to death, Lola? A, a lot of evolution and luck, okay? Now, look, just when you find Asmodeus, don't, don't harsh the vibe. He's real big on having a good time. The cassowary, that, that's what you were talking about. <laughs> Did you hear her, Lola? <laughs> Oh, arch the vibe. <laughs> oh, give me a... The Gulag Archipelago is an important book, all right? And I didn't know that Tim was on shrooms that time. Why do you even have that as an audiobook? Because I jog, okay? It's called multitasking. Bye. <laughs> like, later. Okay, Chad, I gotta go pee. And we'll continue our video game here. This has been so interesting.
Okay, much better. <laughs> Alrighty, how long have we been recording? So this kind of seems like it could just be good for a part on its own, because we met Satan, we did something, we accomplished something, and now we're moving into something. I'm trying to think what I want to do for tomorrow. So tomorrow I definitely want to wake up at a good time, like early, early, and then stream for a long time for Luigi's Mansion. I wonder how long that game's going to be. Um, let me think here, chat. What have you been thinking of this game? I've been loving it. I think it's so fun. I think it's just a good time. <sighs> Feels good to breathe like that. Fell in love with it at PAX East. How's the finger? The finger's good. What time are you streaming tomorrow? I don't know yet. Downloading Luigi's Mansion right now? Okay, I downloaded it before. And felt like... Like I kind of want to check it out. Maybe we could check it out a little bit, and then I could, like, stream it tomorrow. And, like, actually, like, record it and all that. I just really love it. I'm just really in love with the idea of it. Um... I just got a feeling that'd be a good spot to end this episode here, man. Let's do it. Say bye to YouTube, chat. <clears throat> so I'm thinking this is a good spot to end it, chat. We met Satan. He's great. And we got ourselves another new task. <laughs> and I think we'll do Asmodeus first, and then who knows what. Asmodeus was actually in my Pony Island playthrough, which is pretty interesting. So I'm curious to see how he's represented in this game. So thank you guys for being here. We stream every single day on twitch.tv slash swingpoint. It is just about Halloween for me. So happy Halloween for you guys. We'll be streaming Luigi's Mansion on YouTube and probably also Mixer at the same time, though. So I know I said go to Twitch all the time where we do these, but I'm thinking Mixer in the morning in case you're European or you want to watch at work. And then Twitch at night might start being our new drive here, man. So links will be in the description. We'll be doing Luigi's Mansion. It'll be a good time. We'll keep doing After Party on Twitch. It'll be a good time. Follow me on those links. And if you want to support the channel, you can always become a member. It's like a dollar. And that's about all I got. So thank you guys. Ah! Who did that? Okay, ah! goodbye. Who yeah. jump scared me, you dick? <laughs> goodbye, chat. Bye. Jesus, bye. Now I have to redo it? No, I'm going to keep that in the video. Thanks, Ryan. No, that wasn't Ryan. That was Alice. Thanks, Alice. <laughs>